So let's talk about some Google Meet basics. Uh, so let's start with your setup. So the first thing you're going to need for your Google Meet is a webcam. So there's one included on your laptop. If I was going to use the camera included on my laptop, I would take a couple boxes and I would stick my laptop on top of it until it's eye level. So again, it's at a good height for me to look into the camera on the screen. Uh, let's talk about camera basics number two. So now you've got it lined up, we're just looking at you, so now we're setting the scene. We're looking around, we're making sure that there's not a lot of junk behind us. So if we actually turn to the camera, you would see some boxes to, my, uh, to the side of me, so I wanna make sure I don't have a junky looking background in there. Um, so that, that's pretty simple. Also, you wanna be aware of your background. I have a window behind me and so bright lights coming in and so my face is under exposed because there's so much light coming in from the outside. So I have two options. I can, number one, I can shut the blinds and then that exposes me a little bit better. So I'm gonna open that back up and we'll look at option number two. So option number two is I can turn on a light closer to my face. So I can reach up here and turn on a lamp. And then I'm much better exposed and you see my face, there's not a lot of shadow on it. And so that's just a lamp about arm's length away. So very close to me, no lampshade on it, just a bulb. Uh, number two, let's talk about audio. So we get good sounding audio. All of your students, if you're going to let them engage with you and speak, your students should have just some cheap little earbuds laying around that they can plug into their Chromebook or their iPad during this virtual conference call. You should wear some too. Most of you probably have, these are just those um, ear pods uh, that come with the iPhone. So if you'll put these in, it's actually gonna solve another problem. It's gonna solve the microphone issue. So instead of your computer microphone, which isn't very high quality, you'll be able to use this little microphone right here that's on your headphones and when you wear them, it's gonna hang very close to your mouth. So if you wear headphones or a headset with a microphone, it's going to greatly improve the quality of your audio. Be aware of the surroundings for your video. Make sure the set looks good. And then also be aware of the sound going. So are you running the washing machine or dryer and washing clothes? Are you running the dishwasher? Do you have a loud fan going on in the background? Um, so what I like to do is go somewhere where there's lots of things to absorb that sound. So curtains are great for absorbing sound. Carpets great for absorbing sound. Uh, pillows are great for absorbing sound. And it's nice because you don't see anything behind the camera. So I could put stuff close to me to help absorb that sound and just give me nice clean audio and nice clean video for my video conference.